Okay, we're going to start with multiplication. Now, multiplication is when you have a bunch of groups that have the same amount in them, and you're basically adding them all up. Okay, so first, I'm going to make three groups, and each of these three groups are going to have four in them. Now, I can turn this right here into a pretty not long, but I can turn this into a multiplication sentence and an addition sentence. I'm going to start with making an addition sentence. I have 4 plus 4 plus 4. Okay, see that? I have 4 in each group. Each group has the same amount. Like when we're doing with multiplication or even when we're dealing with division later on, your groups are going to have the same amount. And we're adding it together. 4 plus 4 plus 4. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. Okay? So that's 12. Now, one thing that's going to ask you to do in your math book as well, it's going to ask you, it's going to have you like write it out with how many groups of what equals what. So, groups of blank equals blank. So, how many groups do I have? Show me on your fingers. So I have three groups. I have a group here, a group here, and a group here. I have one, two, three groups. So I have three groups of how much? How much is in each group? Please show me with your fingers. That's right. Three groups of four. And three groups of four, how much is that? Show me your fingers and your toes. I'm joking, guys. Okay, three groups of four, like we added them up. There's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Okay? Now, we can use these numbers, these groups, and make multiplication sentences. There's two different ones we can make. Okay? The first one, I can take how many groups I have first. I have three groups, so I can say three groups, and then I multiply by how much I have in each group. I have four in each group. Three times four, guess what three times four is? It is just 12. Okay? So, with multiplication, you're looking at groups that have the same amount, and you're basically adding them up over and over again. So see how I have 3 times 4? I have 3 different 4s, and I'm adding them up. So 3 times 4 is the same as 3 times 3. 4 times plus 4 plus 4. I can also flip-flop it because of the commutative property. Remember my dance move with my hands? Oh, oh okay. doesn't matter which order you add. It's the same with multiplication. It doesn't matter... What order I multiply the numbers, the answer is still going to be 12. Okay, I'll show you right over here. I, I'm going to make four groups of three this time. One, two, three, four. I'm going to put three in each group. And now I'm going to count them all up. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Oh my goodness. It doesn't matter what order I do it in. With multiplication, math is true. The commutative property is true. Now, this time I'm not going to draw out the groups, but I'm going to need your guys' help to solve my sentences, okay? All right, so let's say I have... Three... Groups of five. Can someone tell me an addition sentence with three groups of five? Ooh, an addition sentence. You have to tell me the answer. Just tell me what the number sentence would be. I'm going to write it out. Five 
five plus five plus five. You have five plus five plus five. Because I have three different groups here, each of them with five. Five plus five plus five. Can somebody tell me a multiplication sentence? There's two of them we could do. Two of them we could do. Yes, you can go five times three. You said both of them. And three times five. Who can tell me what that answer is? Fifteen. Fifteen. So five plus five plus five. Five plus three. Or sorry, five times three and three times five. Now, I could have gone three five times. I could go three plus three plus three, plus three, is that four of them? Yeah, plus one more three, and that's going to equal 15 too, okay? But if we have three groups of five, just take how many we have in each group and then add how many groups we have, okay? So that's basically multiplication. We're adding the same number over and over and over again.